Let's have a look at this example. Architects don't often become as famous as other types of artists such as painters, so their work can have a greater effect in the long term. Architecture is essentially the art we live in. You can pause the video and read the entire paragraph. I'll stop over here because I understand the question and it will save us time as well. Okay, so let's apply the rules. The first rule is to cut out the transition word that is so over here. Now, let's read the sentence again. Architects don't often become as famous as other types of artists such as painters. Pause over here and tell me, does this clause or sentence have a positive connotation or a negative connotation? And you will realize that it has a negative connotation. And this is for our understanding. As the clause is saying that they don't often become as famous as other types of artists. That is why it is negative. Let's read the next clause. Their work can have a greater effect in the long term. This is definitely positive. So you see, we are moving from negative to positive. Which category do we need? We need this category, contradictors. Now we are halfway there. Let's have a look at the option choices now. So A is definitely wrong because it has a cause and effect there. B has a contradictor. So we'll keep this. I'll put a question mark here. C has and. This is a continuous, so C is also wrong. D is D has a contradictor, so we'll keep this as well. So now we're left with option choice B and D, and our answer should be D. Why? Because we have got two independent clauses. And remember the punctuation rule? Independent clauses are joined by fanboys conjunctions. This is a fanboys conjunction. And over here, you've got a conjunctive adverb. It must be preceded by a semicolon. That's why option choice B is wrong. Next question. Conditions in the interior of Antarctica are inhospitable to many forms of life. Sub-zero temperatures, high winds, and extreme dryness make it impossible for most animals to survive. The Antarctic Peninsula and the surrounding islands have milder temperatures and liquid water, whereas more animals can thrive there. Now you know the drill. The first step is to cut out the transition word and then read the sentence again. The Antarctic Peninsula and the surrounding islands have milder temperatures and liquid water. More animals can thrive there. My question over here is why more animals can thrive in the Antarctic Peninsula? And your answer would be because the Antarctic Peninsula and the surrounding islands have milder temperatures and liquid water. You look at the reflex action because now you get your answer. We need cause and effect. So A is definitely wrong. B is also wrong. Since more animals can, uh, can thrive there. Now this is also cause and effect, but the best option over here is option choice D. So more animals can thrive there. You see, we have cause and effect. In this scenario, the Antarctic Peninsula, you already have the cause and then you have the effect. And since it's basically the other way around. Please remember that. Next question. Healthy Arctic marine mammals have a thick layer of fat beneath the skin. Tropical marine mammals have very few fat reserves in their bodies. As a result, many of them dwell primarily in the warm waters that surround coral reefs. What is the best way to join the sentences at the underlying portion? Now over here, we don't have a transition word, but everything else remains the same. We read this sentence, we read this sentence, and then we try to come up with the transition category and then the transition word. Okay. Healthy Arctic marine mammals have a thick layer of fat beneath the skin. Now, this is a general statement, so I won't say whether it is positive or negative. Let's just keep it there. Next sentence. Tropical marine mammals have very few fat reserves in their bodies. Now you should see the connection. Like this sentence is the opposite of this sentence. Healthy Arctic marine mammals have a thick layer of fat beneath the skin. On the other hand, or but, or however, tropical marine mammals have very few fat reserves in their bodies. See, this makes perfect sense. So the category that we need over here is a contradictor. You see, everything else remains the same. The strategy remains the same. So option choice A is however tropical marine mammals have. This is perfectly fine. The word is fine but the option choice is wrong. Why? Because we have got two independent clauses and we have a conjunctive adverb over here. And we know that a conjunctive adverb must be preceded by a semicolon. Next, we have so tropical marine mammals. This is wrong because this is cause and effect and we need a contradictor. In option choice C, we have but 
this makes sense but tropical mammals having oh look at this this is the wrong verb we need have so definitely this is also wrong elimination is a very strong strategy you see we have already eliminated three of the option choices so d should be the correct answer whereas tropical marine mammals have very few fat reserves in their bodies it makes perfect sense and d is the correct answer